Hey guys, I'm Kai from Lucas Lane and Royals. Hope you're doing well. Today I'm going to be cutting a clutch of eggs today. This is a uh, Triton to a pastel orange drink. Are you going to... Taking over the channel. I don't What's know going doing. on? Kai Get from Lucas here. Lane and Royals here. So, stay tuned guys as we're going to cut this clutch. So this is the, the pairing for the clutch that we're about to cut. This is a pastel orange dream female. And this is the this Triton is the male. Tri this is the Triton that uh, Ben was talking about. Four jeans, pastel, what is it? Pastel Enchi, pastel orange dream fire. Pastel Enchi, orange dream fire, yep. Look so, it should be fun. And they are both very active right at the moment, which is really funny. So, Let's see what we get. Let's do it. So with me is Kai, as we just said, and uh, we're excited he's visiting, you know, hanging out. And he brought us a couple animals because it makes really beautiful stuff. So uh, we said, hey, why don't you stay for a clutch cutting? And we're gonna cut this. This is our press and seal that we always put on to keep the humidity in. You can see a lot of humidity builds up on top. Um, so we're gonna put that over here. I'll set afterwards. But we have five good eggs here, and we're excited. This is the Triton to Pastel Orange Dream. So our Triton is a Fire Pastel Orange Dream NG. So it's four gene male to a Pastel Orange Dream, obviously two, dream, two genes. But we're hoping to hit some Super Orange Dreams, which would be cool, it'd be our first ones. So you can get in here and we'll check this out. So here we go. We got Kai here to be our expert idea. Yeah. He's got yeah, a I'm good sure. idea. I'm sure that's gonna help. Alright, <laughs> so he's produced way more super orange dreams than us. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. Some feel like they have something in them, so that's a good sign. That's good. They better have something <laughs> in them. Alright, so here we go. Nice gloves by the way. You know it. I'm gonna come in tight. All right. Again, like we say with all of our videos, the reason that we do this is uh, because we like opening our presents before Christmas. It's the real reason. But also, it, um, ooh, I'm already saying something cool. Nah, not as cool as that. <laughs> so, what is that, man? I'd say pastel, fire, enchi. Pastel fire enchi is my call on that. Okay. <laughs> I think I think it's a pastel orange dream. No enchi? We'll have the to wait color. for the or the pattern, especially that piece up there. Got the brain trust here. A awesome. <laughs> little, little bit of a bridging going on. I'm not allowed yeah. to actually look at the snake because I have to focus on the camera. You do that. That is true. All right. All right. Maybe. Next one. We'll see. We'll I don't know. It is. Out. It is. It's much easier to identify Enchi when you see the head. Yeah, that's true. All right. So a little snip here. It's got a little window. A little bit. And this again does not hurt the snakes. Um. The excuse that we all give is that uh, we want to make sure they don't get trapped in the eggs if they don't have their egg tooth. So this helps them to be able to get out. Mm. Oh, that's that's definitely an entry something. Entry I think so. Fire. I think because of how light it is. I'm gonna say this is a super pastel. Orange Dream Enchi. Could be fire, it's hard to say on that one. It's and of course, a little shout out to Matt Cleaver, as uh, this is the, he really wants a mail out of this clutch from us, so hopefully we get something cool. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> what, do you think? what do you think, Ben? I do, I, th I think it's a. I think it's a super pastel? I think it's a super pastel. Yeah, it's I mean, real definitely, bright. Yeah, definitely. A lot of blushing. Has to be the Enchi and the Orange Dream, I would imagine. That's a big one too. That looks pretty chunky there. 
Yeah, it filled the egg out there for sure. All right, next egg. Should be a pied in the next one, right? Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> if, it, if it was a pied in this one, I'd be real happy and confused. <laughs> Our employees are messing us up here. All right, it's again. So, uh, you want to go first? <laughs> I think it's uh, Fire, Super Pastel, Orange Dream, and NG. I can't. I, I don't know if I'll be able to ID the Super Orange Dream, especially this early. Yeah, I think it's NG as well. Super Pastel. Hard to see if it's uh, orange green though. Well, I just look how clean that line is. Yeah. yeah. It's hard to tell with so many because, you know, <laughs> when you don't have that, when you have like NG and orange dream and pastel, you get that white outline, but if it's a super pastel, it's really hard to tell. Yeah. Yep, and that's why we got Kai here because <laughs> we don't know. <laughs> um, but that's how it goes, all right? Egg number four. And this was the, the female's first time uh, laying. So five good eggs is a great, is a great first time. And uh, I'm getting schmuckus wow. all over. Wow, that one actually looks very similar. Yeah. Look at that. I mean, it's crazy that I'm seeing Enchi in so many of these. Well, there's just so many genes. Like, the Super Pastel would help bridge it too, you know? Yeah. The banding as well. But there's definitely a lot of blushing. That's probably a Super, given the color. Mm -hmm. I would say Up here. Yeah. Yeah, I'd agree. A lot of banding, probably Enchi. It is a good shot of Super, I mean. Of Super Pastel, I mean. Yeah. So. Hmm. Same odds as Super Orange Dream. That is. It's just I don't know how to ID Super Orange Dream uh, <laughs> in the egg like this. The Super Pastel is really going to mess with us on with the Super Orange Dream because... I think I'll be able to tell when they come out and you see the head. Yeah. If it's blushed out, it's probably a Super Pastel. If it's not as blushed, it might be... The head markings, you'll have a lot of Triton-like markings on yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It'll be super reduced. The, the, like, the cross or the bow tie pattern. This one is not super pastel, so. I like that. I actually like. Oh wow. I like oh, the we contrast. Can, I can almost see a head here. Yeah, that's got the eye stripe connecting to the chin. That's pastel. <laughs> She's like, come on, what are you doing? Leave me alone. Yeah, I wouldn't call this a super pastel. So. Pastel and she orange dream. Do you see some of the white outline right there, you see? Mm-hmm. I think we did well with the odds. I don't know about Orange Dream though until they come out. Mm -hmm. But it's a cool clutch. For sure. So our expert idea. Mm -hmm. Not an expert at all. <laughs> this is this is why we brought you in on this project, because you know what these all look like. I don't know what they look like. Well no, I mean, yeah, you gotta wait for them to crawl out. We have three that I think are screamers. This will start nice coloring us a lot over the next week. Yeah. I do like it. Yeah. I mean, these, these, these three definitely look like they have more jeans, but I kind of like the contrast, the dark black against the light background. Mm -hmm. but these will color up much nicer. These will be like much brighter for sure. You can see the heads on those, it'd be a good giveaway. We'll yeah. See. Hard to see the head, so thank you very much, Kai. So it looks like uh, we didn't do bad here. We didn't get any just single gene anything, which, uh, you know, we could have gotten just a single gene pastel. So there's that. What's the odds of getting a normal with six it's, genes in the mix? Yeah, it'd be hard, especially with 164, the, I think. Yeah, right? something like that. Maybe. I guess. So the other one was eight genes and it was one in 128. So it's either one in 32 or 64. Okay. Well, thank you very much guys for joining us. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And it, please comment down below if you have any questions or anything like that. And 
We will uh, help us ID these. Yeah, help yeah. us ID these. That in the comments. We'll be uh, keeping you guys in the loop as they come out of their eggs. So thanks guys for joining us and hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to us and to Lucas Landon Royals and hit that notification bell. Is there any words of wisdom you want to give everybody? Go to Tinley. Go yep. to Tinley, that's a good we'll one. Be there. We'll all be there, Tinley. This year, October, whoop. See ya. See you See later. later. Ryan, what's wrong with you and holding snakes lately? What do I know about holding things? Are we hot? Yeah. We good to go? Playing the Royals, hope you're Hang doing on. well. On, you to Today I'm going to cut this clutch. <laughs> Are we filming? Uh, we're, we're hot now, so wow. let's go. Yeah, we're live. No. You're live. You're live. I don't know. Look, you got the camera on him, all of a sudden he's all reserved. <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know what to say now. <laughs> He was like, hey, this guy really doing my hands. Lucas landing in the reptiles. And then you're coming in? Yeah, I'm coming in. I'll just do my intro and then you can come in and interrupt me. Okay.